here we are. He's getting kind of his own way right now. But Oliver's probably the smartest horse uh, uh, of the three of them. There we go. He's probably the smartest out of the three of them. But Frost is kind of my soulmate, so. used to actually be in the first horse out, so it's kind of a, a think man today. The rest of them are sitting at the gate going, oh, if we'd have known we were getting grass, we'd have come out. So he's busily chomping grass. He's going to be six in May, along with Willow. And, you know, when I, I do rescue and horses and stuff like that, and originally I think I did plan to ride them, but I get more joy out of just being around them than actually riding them. And, you know, it's kind of safer too, because if I get hurt, I can't work. And if I don't work, I don't make any money. If I don't make any money, you know, Candy and Derek are just, they're just amazing. They take such good care of the horses. And, you know, in, in a way, they take good care of me by taking good care of the horses, because, you know, they're not... If I call them and tell them I'm going to be late, you know, I hate it every time it happens. Uh, but they're, but they're great. They're awesome. I was hoping to get like some, you know, oh, he shies at silly things. Hey, here we go. So he's kind of not used to the camera. And he's, he's not a baby really anymore, but he's, he's a good boy. He's a really good boy. So you only get his next one to figure out how to do this. There we go. I'm gonna hit the tree with the camera if I do this. So. What I'm trying to do is get go for walks and and talk to them while we're walking. But this is the first time out, so so it's gonna be a little interesting. Anyways, that's the end of walks with Oliver. Uh, Mach one. Thank you.